Next is a little town of Ennis, Montana. Ennis is just a one street town. That's pretty much all there is to do here is to walk up and down the street. You know, a lot of these cities in the West have statues. At home, we have Mustangs that are all of our Ogden that are painted. You see bison in other cities, but in Ennis, fish are king. In fact, this statue cracked us, cracked us up because we have a fish with fish painted on it. That's how into fish they are in Ennis. And so our thoughts about Ennis are that, I don't know if you would go out of your way to come to Ennis unless you're a fly fisherman. Uh, there are plenty of fly fishing excursions you can book on the beautiful Madison River. It is just gorgeous around here and we've really enjoyed our time this morning because it's just these heavenly Montana mornings in the summer. If you ever have a chance to visit Montana in the summer, you've got to do it because you just get away from the heat and it's so peaceful and chill and these old western towns are so cool. But Ennis is nice because of all the fly fishing if that's what you're into. And We've noticed that a lot of the cafes and restaurants, like Montana is so chill, they're kind of like, oh, we might open, we might not. So it's just kind of a chill atmosphere. So we say that Ennis is probably worth a little stop on your way to Virginia City, do a little stroll on Main Street, and then head on your way. Finally, we stayed at the Red Bear Inn and they generously rescheduled our reservation when we got COVID. We definitely recommend staying there if you were in the area.